If the crank is bent, and that's not uncommon, I had a crank a while back that was bent on the race car, and so you throw a rod bearing out of it, and it wedges the rod between the thing, it will twist the crank. Okay. Yeah, bend it. So to straighten the crank, we can actually take 10 thousandths here, 10 here, and 10 here, and make it straight according to the bearings, but still like a banana. Yeah, that still isn't right. It's still out of balance. Right. You'll never balance it. So it will just flop like that, even though it's straight. Yeah. As far as the bearings are concerned. So then we can straighten it. One time I had a crank here. I tried to straight. I bent it down and leave it back up again and gain like three or four thousandths. Okay. Bend it down again, back up again, gain three or four until I got it almost perfect. It took me several times to bend it. Yeah, because I was bending that crank a quarter of an inch. And it, and it would rebound. Spring back up. Yeah. And gain five. Yeah, so the rebound, yeah, you have to do it so incrementally because. Yes. Yeah. Now, yeah. once you do that the last time and it bounces back to the right spot, you're, you're done, right? It there. won't change after that. It'll no, stay. Not really won't. Okay. Yeah, it really won't. 